but yeah, I think I think this video could be pretty relevant for uh, for us uh, as. Uh, because you guys are factorial players and I feel like factorial players have a high like percentage of being software engineers or something in that uh, general proximity of like occupation. Okay, so we're gonna check out this video, A Day in the Life of a Software Engineer. Uh, I think it's like expect expectation versus reality and a little bit fun. So I'm looking forward to, uh, to checking it out and uh, to see what you guys are thinking. Let's let's just let's just jump into it. It's gonna be fun, I think. <coughs> a day in the life of a software engineer, <laughs> working from home. <laughs> Caps lock. He's up at seven seven a.m. Are you up at seven seven a.m.? That is a really nice alarm clock. Holy moly! I want to have one of those. But do you have to swipe on it to dismiss the thingy? Ay ay ay. Oh. And it's getting brighter and brighter, maybe? Lisa, stop. <laughs> he sounds almost dead. Okay, so this is the expectation. Oh, making your bed in the morning. Do you guys make your beds in the morning? This is expectation, so I wonder what reality is gonna be. I work 100% from home. Me too. Or maybe 98%. <laughs> this is the reality. <laughs> Not yet up, I guess. Bedroom off. <laughs> Bedroom off? That is very cool. <laughs> Still there, 7.30. Alexa, start my day. Good oh, morning. sexy. In Redmond, it's 23 degrees Celsius with cloudy skies. <laughs> At 3.30 the reality, there is a though. system design meeting. You have one <coughs> notification from Amazon Shopping. Oh, Amazon Shopping. I feel like, is this you guys, though? Is this you guys? Do you have an expectation of being early up in the morning, but it's always very difficult to get out of bed and then you end up not doing anything in the morning? Uh, what do you... Uh, making a bed? Uh, bad. I just changed uh, position from laying to sitting and push pillow to the side. <laughs> I have kids. Can't sleep in. Yeah, that is like the stronger than an alarm clock for sure. Yes, I woke up at 11 a.m. yesterday and I worked from home. 11 a.m. Wow. I It's a long time since I wake, woke up at 11, 11. I feel like I'm more of the expectation kind of guy in this one than the reality kind of guy, I think. <laughs> at 8 o'clock. But like when you look at it, the expectation just looks so nice though. Starting your morning with like Alexa and then uh, like a good shower and good coffee, talking to your devices. It's a good start in the morning. Expectation. Standing desk, yeah. I don't think he's using a standing desk in the reality though. <laughs> Still not up. Oh my god. Alexa. <laughs> Alexa. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, fuck up, Alexa. I'm not ready to get out of bed yet. Visual Studio. Let's do some programming. But we're not really up yet. <laughs> Being productive, being productive. <laughs> I do feel, feel like it. This would have been me if I didn't have a kid or. Oh, holy shit! This is looking epic though. Just laying there and you have like the screen in the top like that. Wow. Wow. <laughs> and then I'm online. Boop. Daily Scrum. Yeah. All right, Daniel. So yesterday I've completed implementing the APIs. I verified that they're working with no issues, but their average latency below 200 milliseconds and the reliability at 99.99%. <laughs> 99 
<laughs> this is the reality. I wonder how I wonder how that meeting is gonna go with the the real meeting or like how it is in the real world almost. <laughs> Daniel. Yesterday I finished implementing the background worker. I'm very glad that it works without any issues. Today I'll be working on writing the unit test for it and I expect to send out a pull request by the end of the day today. That's it for me. <laughs> that is it. It's not as much. It's not as much. In the other one, he completed the API, and this was just like uh, doing a little bit. I uh, guess he just had to mute their Alexa. Oh no! Oh no, it happened! <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. Got an ad right when it started answering. Oh my god. Ay, ay, ay. I'm so sorry. Rip. Uh, I recently found uh, what uh, uh, always will make me uh, wake me up quick. Quickly, I'm using a uh, cap machine for sleeping apnea. An electric outage wakes me up <laughs> every single time. <laughs> Holy shit, I can, I can just imagine you like <gasps> in the morning and then 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 you wake up. Yeah, that is, <laughs> oh, it's an efficient way of waking up, but I wouldn't say it's a good way of waking up. <laughs> oh my God. Is he gonna drink it like raw? <laughs> No, oh, it's it's uh, shrimps in there. Not really the biggest fan of shrimps, so he's not selling me on that one. But other than that, this looks very nice. Ah, nom, 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 nom. Mm. I wonder what his real breakfast is. <laughs> if you change the coat to bear there, then it would probably be uh, kind of similar to Valdek. Oh, that did not look sexy, man. That did not look sexy. Uh, Linton is calling me. Just give me a second. Just give me a sec. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, that's why I decided to go to sleep in the afternoon. I don't need an alarm clock. Just wake up between midnight and 5 a.m. I don't need caffeine anymore. You don't need that either. In my company, it's very efficient. Five to ten minutes max. Ooh, ooh. With the with the meeting. Damn, 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 damn. Uh, he does too much work. He puts leftover pizza in the fridge. Just leave it on desk. <laughs> Bacteria kill. Yeah, gets killed in oven microwave. Yeah, <laughs> I like that. How rude to call uh, uh, when she knows that you're at work. I know. I know. Ay ay ay. Expectations. reality it's just coffee and trying to stay awake but i really like his setup there though just laying there holy alexa, shit with a but oh no oh uh, ay, ay, ay. i hope it didn't start any alexas out there 2 p.m coding oh is it gonna be fast yeah the monitor above the couch yeah that is important <laughs> This is how I used to program when I was developing. Fast as shit. So fast. <laughs> this is reality. <laughs> how to <laughs> write a file. Yeah, I love it. I love it. I love it. Just Google everything in slow motion, man. I feel like this is 95% of developers out there. So loud. I'm so sorry. Damn. I, I blame the the creator of this video <laughs> for it being so loud. <laughs> Pasting the code just straight in there. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> that is probably like 25% of what about they did in that thing. Give you some things to think about and then uh, talk about what's coming in the near future. And they said, oh, well, you know, you can't really ignore them because they're our best customers. They're giving us the most money. Yep. But that design ultimately results in a quadratic runtime complexity, right? Because they're their costs are a little bit higher. <laughs> you can use a priority queue instead and optimize it, bringing the rent and complexity down to the end of the game, I think. Forward being that your starting point. Cool. It's like slow motion. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye. First plan configuration. Right, thank you. I feel like this is probably the reality in very, very, very many homes. Like when you work from home, you don't give a fuck or shit and you just do whatever you want to or, or just chill and relax. I don't know. I don't know. But I, I feel like actually, tru truth truthfully, 
I was more of the first, uh, or like the reality. No, not the reality. The expectation kind of guy. I was going pretty hard at it when I was working. How are you guys at home? Do you do you go pretty hard, or are you more like the reality? If you're honest, it's allowed to be uh be 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 a bit lazy. I think. You do you. So you were cut off. Can you repeat that? <laughs> and then he gets like a 15 minute break there for the person saying everything again. I need approval for approval for the deployment. Can I get a sign off please? The other guy is probably just deploying, right? He doesn't give a f shit. He just press presses deploy. Need sign off. <laughs> okay, so we didn't just deploy it uh, at least. <laughs> Exercise. That was a really cool thing. It's a it's a Wii. Fun. <laughs> yeah. You could have just as well not done anything then. Making a nice meal in the afternoon after a hard day at work, being productive. Ay ay ay. He went with shrimps two times in the same day. Likes them shrimps. Yum 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 yum. Is it uh, wine in that glass? Chilling out. I wonder what this guy's gonna eat when the uh, reality hits. <laughs> Domino's, yeah, buddy! Oh, now I really want to have pizza. Ay, ay, ay. Breaking news. What is that? <laughs> yeah, Bitcoin. Of course, it had to be crypto involved, right? All software engineers love crypto. Every one of them, every single one, not a single one that doesn't love crypto, okay? It's just how it works. It's the law of nature. It's the... We don't like centralized crypto, okay? We want it decentralized, we want it electrified. Electrified! Is it... It is very cool having it in the ceiling, holy moly. Like, that is something I really want to have, though. A uh, monitor, or not a monitor, but like a projector. Oh, no, don't listen to it. To, oh, okay. 99. 99. Get some good rest. Aww. Aww. But the reality is probably staying up super late. What? <laughs> yeah, he has his phone mounted in like a thing Welcome there. Fire King. I'm Daniel, a software engineer at Microsoft. In this video, I'm going to talk about the reason why I decided to leave Amazon. <laughs> yeah, of course, it had to be a video about leaving your job. Ay, ay, ay. Space expression is going well then, yeah. Just want to check out one Good video, night. okay? Hope you had a great day. <laughs> yeah. The the reality guy, I don't think he had a great day. I'm gonna like and subscribe. Good job there. Good job, job Pirate King.